Well, meanwhile, a Calhoun County bingo hall is back open for business. It's been months since people played at I-20 bingo in Hobson City. Managers of the I-20 bingo say they're ready to go. The hall shut down in March, even though it's been operating out of the same building for years. New managers say it took nearly a year to put everything in place. The bingo hall expects between 50 and 70 people this opening weekend. A lot of them are returning customers. It's a drooling process and it can be very lengthy. First, you have to have a viable charity according to the Calhoun County Bingo Regulatory Commission. And then on top of having that, that you have to go, if it's in a municipality, you have to go to that municipality first. All right, well, I-20 Bingo supports the League for Animal Welfare as its charity. They'll be open Fridays through Sundays starting at 4 o'clock. Right now, police identify a woman suspected of stealing a car with a child inside. Now, all of this happened Wednesday morning at the Exxon station on Highway 25 in Montevallo. A mother got out to pump gas when two people stole her truck with her three-year-old son inside at the time. Police found the car and the child about five minutes later. The child, thankfully, was not hurt. Now, police have identified Sarah Skodalski as the woman seen in the video. She's wanted on several charges, including theft of property and unlawful imprisonment. If you've seen her or you know where she could be, please call the Montevallo Police Department as soon as possible. And I want you to take a very close look at this picture. Oxford police are asking for your help in identifying these people seen here. They're wanted for stealing merchandise from the Bama Fever Tiger Pride store in Oxford. This was on Oxford Exchange Boulevard. If you recognize them, please call Oxford police as soon as possible.